Although the name alone conjures up visions of reptiles running amok, the Gila monster won't be attacking your town anytime soon. In spite of its fierce appearance and the fact that it's one of only two poisonous lizard species in the world, the shy, slow-walking, inoffensive Gila monster is only aggressive when provoked. But when provoked, look out. The Gila monster's defensive response is quick. It lunges or turns and clamps down with its powerful jaws, holding on firmly as it chews in the venom that's secreted through grooves in its front teeth. This venom causes pain that quickly becomes excruciating, and although usually not lethal, the venom has been known to cause death in humans. Obviously, it's best to keep your distance from a Gila monster, and certainly never try to pick it up. But if you are bitten, seek medical attention immediately. Gila monsters can be found on lower mountain slopes and in washes in arid and semi-arid areas from southwestern Utah and northeastern Nevada through Arizona into northern Mexico. They are found from extreme southwestern New Mexico across Arizona to southeastern California. Although Gila monsters are not rare or uncommon lizards, they are infrequently seen even by people living in their habitats. This is due in part to the fact that they spend most of their time underground, as well as to their concealing coloring. Their black snouts make them difficult to see as they watch you from the entrance of their retreats, while the light and dark color pattern of their beaded skin, black and pink or black and orange or yellow, conceals them well when they are resting in the dap of light and shade of a desert shrub. Gila monsters are sedentary denning reptiles whose preferred winter quarters are in highland rocky outcrops, often shared with rattlesnakes, desert tortoises, and other reptiles. In the springtime, male-female Gila monster pairs often share these burrows while they mate. They then retire to the cooler and moister valley underground to escape summer's excessive heat. Their eggs are laid in late summer, hatching the following May. The six inch long hatchlings will eventually reach a mature size of up to 22 inches in length, making the Gila monster the largest lizard in the United States. Their short muscular legs with big feet and claws make them strong climbers as well as powerful diggers. This trait is especially useful when the Gila monster is hungry. Its search and dig diet consists mainly of the newborn and nestling young of rodents, rabbits, and hares. When the opportunity presents itself, Gila monsters will consume birds and lizards and the eggs of birds, lizards, snakes, turtles, and tortoises. Predators that consider the Gila monster a tasty meal include coyotes, owls, hawks, and eagles. Humans used to take quite a toll on the Gila monster population, but state laws now protect these lizards. Probably the biggest threat to the Gila monsters is habitat destruction. So, although you may not actually see a Gila monster, realize that they're probably around, and be careful not to unnecessarily destroy their home. Anytime your vehicle has been parked, Check around and under it before moving it, and drive slowly. Gila monsters do not move quickly enough to get out of your way. If you are lucky enough to spot a Gila monster, do not approach it or otherwise disturb it. Instead, report it to the project biologist who will deal with the situation.